Can I get closer to you on that side? I mean, I can pull you through here. But I'll just walk over to you guys. Well, it's up to you. Cause I can go around or I can pull you right through here. There is. Deep in conversation with this guy, and it's just not paying attention. Well, that's what happened earlier today. I had one actually up uh, by Whale Key, which is why I got confused. Yeah. My dispatcher said it was at the same place, and they, he sent me the wrong dispatch initially, so yeah. I put those coordinates in. Well, if you want to, you can get back on board, bring your ladder up, keep your engine up, and we'll be good. Cooled off from the beginning of August to late July. Well, when we get back on the boat, but about a month ago, we were sitting at 90 degrees in deep water. And we'd get up to about 95 degrees or so in shallow water like this. Oh, what does it say? Yeah, right now we're at 87 degrees. Water's definitely cooling off. Still a lot nicer than doing this in the winter though, when the water's in the 60s.
Okay. Again, absolutely love having this style of toe post compared to the H post we had on the Pro Cat. Still recording. Wait, I'd be at first for that. I think that line might have broke. Lines in good shape. Oh, yeah, look at me, I get to go walk all the way up there again. I was so hoping I'd get to walk out there again. What was that? I'll get it. Don't worry about it. Let's try this again. Untied one just in case we need more. Using the tow line I usually do. Pro cat boat we had. Yeah, you can see the line here, it's nice. Guess it's time to retire that line. Yeah, I'm glad that's what broke. Yeah. At first I thought the eye popped out, which yeah. never had that happen before, but it's also the first time I've ever broke a tow line, so. And it seems to be moving. Yeah, that thing will pull you up no problem. Try this again. That's only majorly embarrassing. Having your toe line direct on you. Hopefully I can back up get deep enough not having to use this blue line again. 
go kite. <laughs> Double it up. I might have enough on here. But I can do it without it. line won't break. This shit's got 30,000 pound braking strength. Yes, sir. What says boat up there, that little cabin cruiser up by the... It's been there for a year oh. on the sandbar. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. So it's a... At this point, an abandoned boat. Yeah, but I usually get them out of there before that. So I don't know exactly what the process is, but there's some process that... Yeah. They have to go through before the state can take ownership of it. Yeah. And once they do that, then they'll do something with it. 
It's just I've never seen a boat stay that long. Yeah, and that's why there's got to be something going on with yeah. it. Yeah. Want to see if you can get your engine started? Yeah. The moral to the story is don't drink and drive. What's a drink? It's don't have friends on board so you don't get distracted. Distraction, yeah, it's always the other guy's fault. <laughs> well, that's a good sound. Oh, shit. Yeah, we sound good. Now, Bill, survey the area first before we get Yeah, down. right. <laughs> You like that boat better, Tom? You want to jump on it? <laughs> it's 24. Are you okay, Do you have a good experience? You're okay. Well, thank you very much. You're very welcome. I'll just get a signature from you. Sure. Perfect. Anything else you guys need? I'd like a cold one now. <laughs> I'll go home and get it. That sounds like a good idea. You're very welcome. You guys stay safe. Nice. Oh, thank you. Oh, thanks. Good one. Clear.